Hello friends, I am Dr. Rajay Kothari. Today we are going to talk about a very important topic and that's called pain management in lumbar spine that is lumbar pain block. It is a very powerful tool to avoid a surgery in the lumbar spine. There are three main types of these injections. These injections are very safe and they are FD approved. So the first injection which we do is called a root block injection which is given through the lumbar foramen. These injections are given under a fluoroscope guidance that is C-arm guidance and that C-arm or fluoroscope guides us exactly to the point where the disc has come out. We can target that point under that fluoroscope and inject the drug. Now what that drug does is it helps to reduce the inflammation in the disc. It helps in reducing the swelling and inflammation over the nerve and it reduces the inflammation of the disc. In turn, the disc shrinks, the root gets free and the pain goes down. So this is the first type called selective nerve root block. The second type of injection is called epidural steroid injection. The epidural injection that has been given is given either through the interlaminar window or caudal epidural. There are two types. The mechanism of action is the same. The drug is predominantly given over the dural sac so that it can span at least three to four levels and it also gives very good pain relief. And the third type is called a facet block injection. It is mainly given for chronic or recalcitrant back pain and it has a very good mechanism of action in which it reduces the inflammation in the facet joints and the pain comes down. Common mistake patients do is they feel that once the pain block is done their job is done but that's not the case. After the pain management the pain comes down but in order to get the pathology out of the picture you have to do very regular exercises, core strengthening exercises, eat a healthy diet and maintain proper posture. Last thing, people feel that steroid is not good for these injections. Let me make a very important statement that we use 1 ml of steroid. This 1 ml of steroid doesn't cause any harm and it is done worldwide. All over the world, in all western countries, America, Europe, everywhere. So please do not fall trapped to that myth that the steroid injection is harmful for our spine. Thank you so much.